we are at Vecino. So, um, I am actually very excited about this place. Yes. Likewise. Um, it was recommended by a colleague of mine by the name of Ashley, um, and she told me that I have to try this place. Now, the reason I have to try this place is because this is a place we call Fusion. Um, it is between Mexican and Korean. Korean. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm so excited hearing that. I was like, yeah, we have to go, we have to go. <laughs> so, it's the first time I've ever been here. It's um, next to Canterbury Station uh, right. here in Sydney. Um, so, we are very excited. <laughs> Uh, we're getting all the recommendations already. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'm super excited and let's see how we go. Yeah. Um, sorry, we just had someone that was very excited, just ate here, <laughs> told us it was going to be good. So, he's just at the, um, the bar very Hi, so we're very uh, excited. So, Mexican food, I am from South America, I don't really can't comment on Mexican food. Um, but I do know Vecino stands for neighbor. Uh, and as a fellow neighbor, <laughs> I really want to see how this place does. Um, I've been told the cocktails are amazing. Oh, I have to give yeah, it a go. We will definitely Anyways, do enough talking. Let's get yeah. right to it. Alright. Um, Alright, let's see how this goes. I'm excited. So this is the screw drew. Um, let's see how it tastes. It's soju, so it's supposed to be sweet. It actually, it's very sweet. <laughs> it feels more like a soft drink, which is very dangerous because I could drink this like nothing. <laughs> you gotta give it a go. Now it's my turn. I'm gonna give it a go. It's like an ice cream. It tastes nothing like alcohol. <laughs> it tastes definitely like a soft drink. Yeah, nothing like alcohol at all. Mm. It's a very nice soft drink. <laughs> It's nice, but I don't think I've ever imagined these two flavors to go with one another. So it's um, it's lovely, but yeah, it's very unique at the same time. Very unique. All right, so I've had burritos, I've had bagoli, but I've never had burrito bagoli. So <laughs> let's give this a go. I'm just trying to get the wrap out. I'm excited. I don't know what this is going to taste like. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh wow. <laughs> I like it a lot. Wow. It's very... Am I crying? <laughs> It is really good. Mm. Like at first I didn't know how to feel, but it, I knew I liked it. But wow, this is a, a very good burrito. So, chimichurri chicken. Let's give it a go. Chicken is so good. Very well spiced. This is good chicken. Very, very good chicken. So the burrito was good. Karen says the chicken's really good. So we gotta give this a go. 
Now we've got the chicken and we got some sort of dip. We'll dip it this time to ha have a different reaction from carrot. I'll show you the I think that's ketchup. Either way, this is so good. Mm. The chimichurri was here. Mm. There's nothing way of eating this. thing that we're gonna do this is on actually on my way but whatever at the final drink um, we tonight. have the <laughs> bonita senorita um, the last drink was so good I just need to know I just need to know so let's see how this one compares to the other cocktail uh, okay. mm. wow oh it's like oh. Strong strawberry glass in your mouth. Strawberry, this one has a bit of passion, passion fruit, doesn't fruit it? as well, yeah. But I think it's clean from the spider. Yeah. Wow. That is so good. Very delicious. Dangerously delicious. I don't see this lasting very long. We're going straight to the city. We're not driving after this. So, what did you think? It was so good. Oh wow, the drinks, the food, I love the chicken. <laughs> I could not stop eating like, I literally like, I don't want to film because I just want to eat. That's, yeah, <laughs> I, I actually loved the food. Mm. Um, it was such an amazing concept. Yeah. Like, um, bagoli beef is something I have, I love about Korean food. But when you mix it with like burritos, burrito? yeah. that was a unique and it was an interesting experience mm. in itself. Yeah. Um, what did you like best? Which one did you like best? I, I All of them. Oh my gosh. I love the chicken, but the drinks is so good. Like the one with the ice cream in it, the screw, screw jar. Yeah, that one was screw no, you or the, whatever that was. The screwdriver Jew or something, something like that. <laughs> it, it, had a, it had an interesting name, but that ice cream was, was delicious. So good. Oh that ice cream was delicious. And then when it melts, and then you can just mix it in with the drink, it was just amazing it's dangerous because it, it <laughs> tasted like soft drink it really but did. it's actually alcohol and like drink enough of those you're gone yeah no, um, for sure. but yeah no definitely um i love that one what did you think of the quality overall oh that was so good like i would say it's like for me it's like a four and a half to five like it was so good like i i'm trying to think of what i would not like about it but i really liked everything about it so Five out of five. You know. Five out of five? Yeah, five out of five. Five out of five is very accurate. <laughs> uh, the food was really good. The um, the concept is amazing. Yeah. Fusion between Mexican and Korean. Uh, definitely did not disappoint. Uh, I wasn't sure what to expect, but the, the expectations were high and it was met. So I'm very happy with it. Presentation. Uh, definitely up there as well. They really did really well with presentation. I'd say like almost like a four and a half. Four and a half? Yeah. I would definitely agree with four and a half. And the reason I wouldn't say it's a five is more because of the table size. I thought it was a little bit small um, then, and yeah. not enough room. But then again, like that's a very... It's a small, it's, it's a very like, it's kind of like a cafe type of feel yeah. because of that. That's why everything's a little bit smaller. But yeah, that's just a very minor yeah. kind of like comment, I would say. Yeah, like it's not even to take too much of a notice. Um, 
I would definitely recommend this for a date night type of yes. scenario. Yes, definitely. Date yeah. night in very small friend groups, like maybe up to four to six would four be to six. appropriate. We did, see, we did see a few groups of six people. Yeah. Um, it's quiet enough for you to be able to have a good conversation. Mm. So yeah, like I definitely would suggest this for uh, first dates, 10 dates, anniversaries, whatever you feel like. It's actually a good place. Yeah. How about service? Uh, I'd say a good four, four and a half. Like they uh, was very attentive and yeah. very polite. Um, yeah, like I think it was very decent. Yeah, it was a solid four for yeah. me as well. Uh, they were very polite. Um, they constantly came to us, made sure everything was okay, asked us if we wanted anything to be removed from the table, uh, which is very nice. Um, we told them what we would like removed, and they only removed that. Um, they didn't um, intervene. They didn't um, push themselves too much. It was just the right level of service. Yeah. I think a four and a half is a more accurate representation. Yep. How about as an overall experience? Five. Five? <laughs> <laughs> we have given four and a half, but yes, yeah. five is a, it's an, um, an overall. It's an overall because like the food, the quality of the food matters the most. Everything else is like very minor, but yeah. it really hits that really high mark anyway. And I'm like, I'd be generous. <laughs> I'm just the, kidding. The, it's actually really good. The food is actually worth it. Yeah, the like, food is really nice. So. The, the um, cocktails are actually so good. We had to get two. Yeah. We we need. I want to know. more, but yeah, maybe not. Um, <laughs> we gotta time. drive. We have to drive. So next time we'll get another flavor, like the few other flavors. <laughs> this is definitely a place I would come time and time again. Yeah, for sure. Like there are so many things I wanted to try on the menu. Yeah. And it is so hard to have it all in one take. Yeah. I would definitely come back to this place Same. many times. Definitely. But yeah, overall I enjoyed the experience, um, and. Yeah, I would recommend it to anybody. It's right next to the station uh, of Canterbury. Like it's, what, two minute walk, yeah. three minute walk? Yeah, two uh, minute walk. Yeah, no, so if you guys are looking for the next place to try out, if you're looking to take out um, a date for the first time, or you're having a small party, definitely come to Vecino, as it is one of the like best places we have been to. Um, other than that, thank you so much, Ashley, for recommending mm. this place. This definitely was worth it, and I'm not too sure if we actually got to show how much we enjoyed it, but we did. Um, other than that, like, share, comment, subscribe, and let us know what you want us to try out next. We are always happy for suggestions. Just let us know in the comment down below, and we will try and get there as soon as possible. Other than that, yeah. bye. Yeah.